When building and testing agents in Agent Builder, you often need to provide specific context to test your agent's behavior. This can be tedious and time consuming. So in this video, I'll show you how to use Agent Forest preview conditions to set the agent's context while testing and building and save you time and effort. Let me quickly show you how this works with an employee agent. Say I need to test how my agent behaves on a contact record within the Coral Cloud app in my Salesforce org. When you use an employee agent like AgentForce default in your org, it considers where you are in Salesforce when responding to your prompt. So you can ask a question like, summarize this contact's interests while on a contact record page. And it'll assume that this record is a record you're looking at. However, in Agent Builder, the conversation preview starts with a general context. So if you ask the agent to summarize the contact's interests, it'll ask you which contact. To fix this, all I need to do is open the preview conditions, set the app, the page type, the object type, and a specific record. So what does this do? Well, by defining these details up front, preview conditions simulate the exact environment your agent needs for your test. The app reloads the conversation preview using the new context. So when I ask to summarize this contact's interest, it instantly uses the preset contact record context to build a plan and fulfill the request. This leads to more accurate session previews, lets you precisely test specific behaviors, and also makes it easy to validate scenarios that require specific data. Now, Let's consider a customer facing agent like the service agent. For service agents, context is also crucial. Context might include things like the customer's language, their ID, their email address, or even some data that's passed through the agent API. But just like before, you can set these test values directly in preview conditions. For example, this service agent is a concierge agent. If you wanted to test this agent's ability to generate a personalized schedule of activities for guests, you'd generally have to type the customer's email and member ID into the conversation. But with preview conditions, you can preset the customer email and member ID variables that I set up earlier. This adds those variables to the context to the agent session automatically. So again, when I ask the agent to generate a personalized schedule, it retrieves the relevant customer details using these preset context variables without me typing anything into the chat. This lets you thoroughly test personalized customer journeys and ensure that your agent handles different customer data accurately and efficiently. If you enjoyed this video and you found it helpful, give it a like. To stay up to date on the latest Asian Force Dakota content, subscribe to the Salesforce Developer YouTube channel. We'll see you in the next one.